In the ancient wisdom traditions of Ma'at and Stoicism, a unifying ethos emerges. The virtuous human rejects idleness and excessive judgment of others' affairs. Instead, one should diligently cultivate skills, knowledge and reason to positively contribute to the world. The Maitian ideal, embodying order and truth. Mayat, the Egyptian concept of cosmic harmony, truth and balance, stood opposed to Isfet, the concept of disorder, chaos and falsehood. To uphold Mayat was to live righteously by rejecting lies, striving for justice and embracing societal roles that created beneficial order. From this perspective, absorbed focus on rumors and gossip breeds Isfet by sowing misinformation and discord. In contrast, mastering productive abilities allowing one to provide value and service to others is an embodiment of Ma'at. Be it a craft, profession, art or intellectual pursuit, the diligent practice of skills from which society benefits upholds the virtues of order, truth and right living. The Stoics viewed human beings as inherently rational creatures bound by justice and duty to positively contribute to our communities. They rejected obsession over trivialities and others' personal affairs as unproductive vice, violating our potential for constructive impact. Instead, the virtuous path focused on constantly cultivating practical wisdom, knowledge and expertise to put to its highest use. This allowed one to best fulfill roles and societal obligations through developed skills and abilities, be it as a scholar, craftsperson, artist or professional. As Musonius Rufus taught, one should devote themselves to efforts worthy of human beings. For both philosophies, idleness and judgmental fixation on others represents a pitfall of unfulfilled human potential. In contrast, the masterful and ethical application of our consciousness, efforts and reasoning faculties in skillful, productive pursuits is the highest calling. It creates real benefit while embodying the ideals of harmonious living. By diligently refining expertise to positively shape the world, one transcends pettiness and lives an upright, purposeful existence, aligned with these venerable traditions' vision for righteous contribution to society.